All right, let's talk about the secrets of the Navigator Panel. Really, I could have just said the secret of the Navigator Panel because who uses the Navigator Panel? It can be found under Window Navigator, and it's actually really, really cool uh, if you've ever used it. Now, I'm going to make it a, a bit larger here. One of the cool things about the Navigator Panel um, is the fact that no matter how far zoomed in you are to your uh, document, you can always see the image in the navigator panel. And in fact, you can grab the square in the navigator panel and navigate to a specific part of the image. Let's say I want to work on the front wheel of this truck, right? We can always zoom using the slider down here, or you can even just click the icons like a button and that's going to zoom. One of the other cool things is you can actually punch in a specific percentage, let's say 128% and go to that percent by hitting the enter or return key. That's percentage of zoom that is. That is the hidden power, the hidden secret of the navigator panel. It's useful for all kinds of things, especially if you do a lot of full screen editing where you take away your panels and you're jumping into sort of full screen mode with Photoshop. You can bring out the navigator panel and if you're zoomed, uh, you know, way, way in, you can quickly navigate to a different part of your image, go ahead and do what you need to do to that part of the image and then bring that navigator panel back out, get up to another part of your image and so on and so forth. That's it, the navigator panel. Get it? Got it? Good. Nathaniel Dodson, Tutvid.com. I'll catch you in the next one.